Hello, everyone, and welcome to the podcast for You Drive Me Crazy. Tonight's episode, I think, was a bit of an improvement over last week's, but still, to me, a lot of the characters are just going completely crazy. I guess, hence the episode title. My having nightmares still about Miles. and But there was a nice scene she had with Zig. Um, I love the Maya and Zig, you know, dynamic, and it, and it was really great seeing them. And it's it's that cheesy, fun, sort of best friend relationship where you do, you know, embarrassing things around each other, and, and it was just great. Um, I love the scene where Maya thought that uh, uh, Zig and Grace were going to be getting high, uh, but instead they're doing yoga. And that's what I thought that they were doing as well. So that was a nice little scene. Um, and then Maya just kind of goes crazy. You know, she sees Maya sleeping on the couch and uh, she thinks that he killed himself after hacking his face range page, you know, and obviously he didn't do that. He just is feeling sick. And then Tristan is there uh, making him soup and all that. And then he gets mad and everyone's mad and everyone's worried about Maya and all Maya's worried about is Miles. So it's just this big, crazy mess right now. Uh, but some incredible acting from Olivia tonight. Um, absolutely love, you know, Maya. And, and I really want to see, you know, where they're going to go from this, even if it was a bit overly dramatic. Also on the episode, Imogen, one of my favorite characters still on the show. A uh, very cute scene with her and Jack. I love them together. I love everything about them. Um, you know, I love the I love you scene, and uh, and, and Jack says thanks. Um, it was very funny. Um, you know, but again, a little bit overly dramatic um, in their plot. But still, you know, it was nice to see um, Imogen and Eli having a great scene together because I've always enjoyed uh, their work together. And of course, Eli is going through a sort of similar situation with Claire and Drew. So that's obviously why they had that, and it was a great parallel. So, you know, the Imogen and Jack plot, uh, I'm, I'm enjoying that. And finally, some stuff with Frankie. Uh, she officially left the squad, and so basically, you know, there's a whole homework thing and blah, blah, blah. Um, but th this uh, plot revolves mostly around Frankie seeing her brother's uh, comic book that he's making and overreacts. Um, and, you know, because he's talking about killing um, people on the cheerleading squad, you know, zombies and all that. And, you know, um, Chewie basically says you should go to the police. And a lot of uh, overdramatics on this episode. But still, you know, some inter interesting plots. Um, and I gotta say, I did overall enjoy this episode more than last week. Uh, next week's episode, a bit creepy with that doll. Um, and somebody knows the true way uh, the cheerleading or power squad, whatever it is, uh, is getting their money. And uh, Zoe is very worried about that. So that will, uh, will be interesting to see. And who is behind that doll. I can't wait to find out. Thank you so much, everyone, for listening to the podcast. Hope you all enjoyed it, and I will talk to you all next week.